Ooh, something big got it. What is up, everybody? This is John with Archer Fish. I am on the Estero River kayaking for the first time. I'm here with my dad. We're gonna try to catch some bass. See you in a minute. <laughs> Well, I finally saw, at least saw a decent sized bass. Oh, there is a fish under, there's a bass under it. Yeah, that's why he was freaking out. There's a fish checking it out. No, he didn't even get it? Oh yeah, he's gonna get it. He's about to get it. Oh yeah, he did. All right, first Estero bass, not bad, little guy. But there's a couple more over here, so maybe we can get another one. It's crazy oh, snook, baby. Couldn't get a picture, though, of course. So, my first time kayak fishing. My first time in a kayak, I think. And so far, I'm not a fan. Ready? Settle down. A fish. A fish. What kind? I'm a little busy. Hang on. Oh. <laughs> Make sure it lives. It's a bass. A bass. All right. It's a nice spawner. She's on a bed. She tore up that shiner. What a beautiful fish. Of course, I got a fish on. Okay. I got a fish on, too. You got one? Yeah. Oh. Alright, so... We caught a few fish, caught that nice like four pounder. Still does not make this any easier to do. It is a pain in the butt. I told you you were gonna catch one. There's one right in front of me. See, it's like you're trying to sneak up on these fish. Oh look. See that? I hope you guys saw that heat. That was super cool. Another juicy one. Look at this fish. God. Dude. I hope you guys saw that heat. That was really cool. Barely hooked. Another probably three pounder. Maybe two and a half. little one but on all right so I'm just about out of shiners and my dad is out of patience got any shiners left there's a couple little males swimming around oh damn I just got a huge swirl on my bait something big got it yeah I don't know we're about to find out oh it's huge got it yeah Snook. 
Or bass, big bass, big bass. Oh yeah, good fish. Good. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm... Oh jeez, it's like a six pounder. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna have to try to land it. I don't have time to get the net. <laughs> oh, she's under a log. Come on, get out of there. Oh, no, no. Let swim out, John. I can't. I'm never doing this shit. Me either, bro. Stupid. All right, so I just lost a I knew it. The only thing I can say is, at least we found, like, I should have just tightened my drag and just forced her up, yeah. you know? I, I gave her too much time to run, and I've got braid, so I could have easily fought her. So that was my mistake. Damn it, that was such a beautiful fish. That would have been my biggest fish in, like, a, a year. I know, right? All right, unfortunately, so we had one shiner left. We went, came up to this pool and I threw in and right away it was a massive swirl on the surface. And so I knew I had a big fish. And uh, when I set the hook, I saw it was a big, it was a good fish. Probably a six pounder, maybe five pounds. I mean, just a monster fish for this little river. Um, and I, sh I played her a little too much. I've got braid on. I could have just kind of horsed her up and I should have because it's so shallow and if you can see right here she got me wrapped up under it and as soon as she did in any other place even you know out in california any of the other place i could easily get that fish out of there but because of this stupid kayak i can't control it so the fish is basically controlling me and it's going backwards and you know she had all the room to just get tangled up and snap that's heartbreaking because i've not caught a five or six pound bass in a long time probably not since last early last year you know at one of the other lakes so that's kind of heartbreaking to me because uh she was a beautiful fish i hope i got some of that on video anyway that was the last shiner these kayaks suck although next time i know how to come prepared with like very minimal gear and i kind of know the spot so you know it, it's been an amazing day and as i've always said the heartbreak makes those achievements all the sweeter you know missing a fish like this sucks because i've not caught a decent bass in a long time the cool thing about it is when i do land a big fish i thought it was a snook that's how big it looked in the water next time i do catch a big fish though it's going to be all the sweeter because of something like this it's heartbreaking and i'm pissed because it's all the kayak crap but anyway that was awesome and a way to end this video thanks for watching i'll see you tomorrow something big got it